In Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare 2, many characters have variants, with some of these variants being electric. When characters have an electric ability, they are able to do electric damage, but also to the enemies if they are in a crowd together, they are able to do electric chain damage. While this is a unique quirk for electric variants of characters, one character breaks the game having this ability. In today's video, I'll be talking about how Electro P breaks Garden Warfare 2. So what exactly makes Electro P so good? Well, it's simple. P shooters are known for having splash damage. And what does this mean? Well, this means every single time the Electro P shoots, whether it's actually on the opponent or somewhere nearby the opponent, they'll be hit by an electrical splash damage move. Now, while this doesn't sound bad on paper, Let's look at the Electro P's damage. Electro P is the only electric variant in the whole entire game to be able to do more damage than the original character. With P Shooter at max being able to do 35 damage with a direct hit and Electro P being able to do 36. And when it comes to splash damage, while almost every other P Shooter is able to do 10 damage at most, the Electro P takes it up a notch and is almost able to do double with an astounding 18 damage at most with their splash damage. And you thought we were done? No, we're just getting started. On top of this, the Electro P has a quirk where he can detonate his shots before they actually touch the ground. This ability has a 3.5 radius and at most is able to do 27 damage. Not to mention, when I was testing it, I don't see any damage drop off, which means you can just be annoying and spam this if the zombies have to defend their graveyard in the middle, making them all take that damage, plus the chain electric damage. Not to mention the Electro P can upgrade his reload speed to where it can be incredibly fast. And if you shoot at a good timing, you can pretty much get unlimited ammo. Because by the time that last P comes out, you'll already be back at full ammo. Which basically means if you time this perfectly and are running the correct upgrades, you can basically shoot forever and never stop applying pressure. And if you couple this with the fact that the P shooter also has the ability to either do super speed or can do super high jumps in the air and the P shooter's normal really small hitbox and the fact that he also has a chili beam bomb or the P Gatling to still do extra damage, the Electro P is a monster and cannot be beat. Overall, with all of these facts and abilities the Electro P has, this is why I think Without a doubt in my mind, the Electro P is the best character in Garden Warfare 2 and breaks the game completely.